Hey, 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 guess who's back with another unboxings and review. Uh, this time I actually have a Accutech scale. Um, so I do a little bit of shipping uh, here and there and I always uh, buy the shipping online. So it's always great to have a scale um, on hand just so you know exactly uh, what weight to, to enter. So you don't overpay for shipping. So this is if you're starting a new business, a small business, or you just ship a lot of stuff online. Um, definitely go with uh, with a scale it will save you money in the long term so this one is the Accutech WA250 uh, and it's rated to up to 50 pounds um, and it does have a 10 year warranty and it's probably one of the one of the easier scales to use even if you have bigger or smaller packages uh, so without further ado let's uh, let's get to the unboxing so um, let's start unboxing to see what's inside So first of all, I see it comes with um, three batteries. Um, so I guess it is, it's both an outlet and battery just in case uh, you lose power. Um, so that's pretty awesome. You can always use it even if you're on the go. All right. Um, it does come with a manual, which is great. Um, the scales are very, very easy to use. So I don't think you'll actually need to use the manual. Um, but just in case. Okay, so f out of the box it says, please remove the cardboard uh, under the scale. So, oh yeah, there is some cardboard. So let's let's remove that. And that's because if you weight anything, then it will just throw off the weight. Um, so in my case, I'm just going to use the battery. So again, three three batteries. And let's see. Find something to cut them out with. Right. Okay, easy to use. I don't think I need to show you guys how to um, install a battery set. Fairly easy. Okay. So let's see. Sometimes you need to um, basically ensure that the scale is performing well. So my scale is already at zero zero, as you can tell. Maybe you can tell on video, maybe not. Um, but it's cool. Right out of the box, you have uh, a power button. You have a pounds and slash kilograms, and then you have a zero zero button. So this is basically to zero it out. If you want to um, maybe weigh something in a container, you can weigh the container first, uh, put it at zero zero and then add the contents just to see what uh, what the weight of this contents is and it does have a hold button so I guess if you have a bigger box and you won't be able to see the top uh, then it's really useful because you can just place the box press the hold button and then it's just gonna hold the, the weight for you so alright hopefully this angle is a little bit better for you guys um, but basically what I want you guys to see is how sensitive this scale is so I have one of the yellow envelopes that I um, I use quite often. So right now, let's zero it out. I press the hold button. All right, and off the bat, you can see that this is weight uh, weights 0.6 ounces. So 0.6 ounces, it's not even an ounce. Um, so the other cool thing I noticed about this scale is you can open it. And then this still zero zeros, so if you have bigger items uh, or if this envelope was full of stuff, you can always place it down, and then it would tell you the the weight again. So it's 0.6 ounces, so it's accurate both ways. So next, I have some uh, small headphones, and this ones we come in at 1.4 ounces, which is awesome. Um, and then last but not least, I'm going to do a bigger box for you guys to see that, you know, you can use this for bigger boxes as well. All right. So, as you can see, it's a little bit hard for me to see. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the hold button. So I press the hold button and now I can remove the box and still see how much it weighs. So in this case, it came in at 7 pounds, um, 4 ounces, uh, 4.9 ounces. 
as you can see and then it holds it all until about you press the the hold button once more and then um, it goes back to zero zero and of course because I'm holding it up yeah it won't zero out so make sure it's on a flat surface as I said I highly recommend this skill uh, it's probably one of the better ones out there you can weight both small and bigger items and it can hold up to 50 pounds um, so if you have a small business or maybe you start a, a, a small shipping store online uh, and you need a scale this will save you money so I highly recommend it um, so thanks for watching uh, if you enjoyed this video uh, please give it a thumbs up um, and subscribe and let me in the comments below, let me know what else you'd like me to um, unbox and review on my channel. Thanks for watching.